Hey, I'm Keaton with Incident IQ, a workflow management platform built for K-12. Incident IQ features tools for health ticketing, asset management, HR, and facilities maintenance teams. But today, we're gonna to be spending five minutes taking a look at what you can do with Incident IQ's asset management. Let's get started. Incident IQ gives tools districts need to accurately and quickly check out devices to their users. So let's take a look at Rollout Scout, where we can check devices out to our students and also seamlessly track that storage location for reporting purposes. All we'll have to do to return these devices from our students is grab that device, scan the asset tag, and it'll be returned back into our inventory. Again, seamlessly reporting and gathering that information for where we're storing these devices. The continuous scanning makes it very easy to efficiently do so. And even here at the end, we'll be able to easily track any tickets or damage the device might have been returned with alongside any fees for any accessories not returned from our users. Now we can assign ownership of these devices back to our users with two quick scans. All we'll need to do is indicate the user we wish to check the device out to, or we can then, without having to click anywhere on the screen, scan that device out that we are wanting to check out to this user. Incident IQ will also give the option for touchless deployment. Use your district NDM's recent login information to have your assets assigned to that correct owner. Another way we can assign ownership within Incident IQ is through My Classes, where we can empower our teachers with simple and intuitive tools, even the ability to use their own device web camera to assign ownership to and from their students. And to keep from teachers and students' learning time from being disrupted, Incident IQ also has a spare pool manager where we can easily get backup devices into our users' hands. Incident IQ features powerful API-driven integrations with your district MDM and SIS solutions allowing us to securely sync in your district data, giving your IT team that up-to-the-minute asset and user information. You'll also be able to generate a wide variety of port reports from dozens of data points from these MDM integrations, like maybe our devices that are assigned to students and being logged into by the wrong student, maybe all of our eighth graders at our middle school who have not had a device checked out to them after deployment, or maybe even students that have left our district who still have a device that we need to collect back from them. These can easily be funneled into reports and even shared with our district stakeholders so everyone that needs to be can be looped in. These MDM integrations will even allow us to perform quick device actions, like disabling or deprovisioning a student's device. Incident IQ will also give your district tools to audit and verify your devices whether that be through recent login information for your students' devices, or whether that be using tools like the Incident IQ mobile app, batch actions, or barcode scanning to quickly audit and verify your devices. This will also allow you to send these reports and even alerts to any stakeholders who may need to be keyed in on that information. Your agents will also be able to save time by automating actions with Incident IQ's rules engine. With no coding necessary, you can easily set up rules to fire off within Incident IQ. So upon a device checkout to a student, we can then have that student written as the owner. We can assign that device to that student's location. We can write back any device changes to the MDM and even send that user an email alert letting them know they've received a device. With Incident IQ, we make it easy to manage groups of assets at one time. In a grid view here, I can grab a list of all of my hotspot loaners and quickly move, change their status, or even set information to all of these assets in bulk. Another tool we'll have is our rapid scan. If I had a laptop brought to my desk, I could quickly scan that asset tag and see a quick view of some of the information for that asset. But if we had a group of laptops dropped on our desk, we can continue scanning these assets, get them into this grid view, where again, we will now have those batch actions we could perform on a list of devices. For teams on the go, there's Incident IQ Mobile. Our iOS and Android native app makes it easy to look up and assign devices in the field. You can even use your phone's camera to quickly scan assets and perform some of those same batch actions we just saw. And that's about it for my five minutes. If you want to learn more about how Incident IQ can transform your K-12 workflows and asset management, help ticketing, and facilities maintenance, visit us at IncidentIQ.com.